welcome back to Final Fantasy VII Rebirth. I almost said remake, which technically wouldn't be wrong because it is the remake. But this is Rebirth. I'm talking about protein shakes, man. I got me a protein shake. Man, I love those things. But anyway, last time we were slaying at the Gold Saucer. Um, I think we already checked this. Yeah, this is the level boost materia. Okay, so let's... Um, we'll save the rest of the things here for later when we are higher level. Because they're, they're rough. I, I'm pretty sure they're doable, but they're rough. Um, let's check out the speed scare. I want to see if there's any updates to the, the bike. Welcome, cadets. To We've arrived Our mission today is a vital one, and we will need your wholehearted support. This is this. The oh, the, the bike is over in the um, I think it's the Wonderment points. Square. Okay, so we're done with this. Um, let's see if there's anything new here though. Ready for blast. No, there's nothing new here. I mean, if we need to grind points, I can come back and get the rank 3 thing, but I won't I won't make you guys suffer through that. If I do that, I'll just kind of say what I'm doing and probably just snip out highlights if anything exciting happens, but I doubt it because there's nothing really exciting happens in that. Um, let's go to the Wonderment Square. Whoever did the voice acting for this NPC sounds like, um, sounds almost like, I, I don't know if anybody's familiar with Rugrats, the, the, the cartoon. Um, I used to watch that all the time when I was a kid and my daughter loves it. But whoever did the voice acting for this particular NPC right here sounds almost like Susie, <laughs> which I think is hilarious. Okay, let's see if there's any new um, Queen's Blood stuff. Okay, let's let's try. Um, let's just go for it. We can always retry. Um, let's forfeit these two. Start with our cactuar. Oh, I didn't realize we had it. Oh. So what is, okay, so replace an ally car, ally. So you can overlay that on like the cactuar. And raise the power of allied cards on the affected tile by the replaced ally's power. Oh. So, you, oh, that could be busted. So if you drop, like, if we drop Titan, like, um, um, let's do, okay, let's drop a card first. So if we drop Titan, like, right there, you could replace Titan with Chadley, and then these four cards in those slots would get a boost of five. That's redonkulous. Um, let's do that and then I feel like he's probably going to play that, that space in the middle to take our spaces interesting play very interesting play Okay, let's do that. 
Ah, uh, he's going to play the bottom, take the top spaces. I see what you're doing. Hmm. Let's do that. He's probably going to take that space though, right? Oh, that's that's fine. We can put an ogre up top or on the bottom to get the spaces on top. I don't think that's going to be... Okay, let's drop Titan. And then we'll swap out... Yeah, it's not enough. <clears throat> you know, we should probably should have swapped out the magic pot for something else. Um, let's forfeit... Uh, just that one. We're gonna dump our cactuar there. Interesting play. Yeah, I think we'll go with that. Kind of sucks sacrificing a two space for that, but um, if we get a sweeper, we can put it in the space below. Hmm, this is exactly what I didn't want to happen. Okay, let's go for that, because <clears throat> he needs. Or no, I don't know if I don't know if he's necessarily. Okay, that's fine. Seriously? The benefit to this, though... Yeah. I still don't think that's going to be enough, though. So let's drop Titan there. As long as he doesn't have a four card, he can't win. And as long as this one doesn't destroy anything. Ooh. 
There's a wrinkle. Oh, come on, man. Really? Okay, let's swap out our magic pot. We'll swap out magic pot for... Let's do that. Um, what other cards do we have? I, I want something with, like, good range. Which I don't think we're gonna get. I didn't want to do that. Okay, well, we'll save that three space in the middle there for, um, what was it, the Mithril Golem? Okay, let's... Um... Hmm... Let's get rid of that. Seriously? I have no one cards? He's gonna take my space. Hopefully he doesn't... Okay. Thank you. I need that space up there, though. That is such garbage. Okay, well, this is going to be huge, though. I don't think he can win. Yeah, there's no way he's beating that 24. Get wrecked. That's a that's a nice play there with the uh, the mithril golem. Ooh, that's a cool card. Cool card indeed. Thirty-two bit flames, huh? Materia guardian.
that's actually really cool. When first enfeebled, lower the power of enemy cards on affected tiles by six. Let's go for it. Um. That is an option. I want to secure that space in the middle, though, first. Whatever, we can always retry. Ooh, and we have our three space. Okay, so let's drop Titan here. Um, you know what? I'm going to drop this here now, just so he doesn't screw anything up. Ha, get wrecked. And that should do it. Okay. Wow, 120 points for that. Compete in a relatively forgiving match spanning three rounds to see how many total points you can accrue. Win and receive a reward based on your total, your point total. A support card will be added to your hand at the start of round one. You will draw five cards at the start of each round. You cannot draw cards during the round. Interesting. Let's try it. The question, I guess, is can we swap cards out before the round, though? We can. I am... I'm happy with that. Woo! Oh boy! Oh boy, oh boy! I'm gonna play a sweeper in the middle there. Or yeah, the bottom, my bad. Um. Hmm. Let's do the sweeper here first. And then we'll drop this. Hmm. 
<laughs> Let's do that. I'm waiting for him to drop a card in that top space there. Not gonna do it, is he? Oh, he doesn't have cards left. Not gonna lie, these cards are kind of garbage. Okay, we're going to play our Cactuar on the bottom. Unless... Yeah, and 8 and 5 is 13. We can't take that bottom space either. Like the, the plus three. That's a different card. Okay, let's go with that. We're going to play our Ogre on the bottom. We're going to get Titan on the top. First order of business actually is going to be this. gonna drop oh we can't drop Titan there oh crap my bad oh stupid I can drop Titan right there <laughs> I not gonna lie didn't even see that okay I think we got this round in the bag Yeah, he can't do nothing, so. 
40 to 31. Ooh, nice! When played, destroy enemy cards on affected tiles. Wow! Oh, you have to intentionally? Oh, never mind, never mind. You have to get 50. Oh, okay, we'll come back for that. Because I think we'll probably have to do that for one of the um, one of the things for um, Johnny's thing, the, uh, the 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 hotel, the inn, whatever you want to call it. Um, okay, nothing new there. I have a feeling there's going to be something new here though, because it's a combat thing specifically. I was really expecting something new here. Nice, uh, nice allusion to probably more than likely a mini game we'll see in the next part of this. Okay, so I don't think there's anything else we can do. You can change your points oh, make whoops. Sure to come back once you racked up more points. Hey there. Got a big pile of points to trade me? Okay, so it's just the turbo ethers sure there. So let's go back to the sky wheel square. I think it was here. Are you ready to care to spend some of your points? Yeah, it was. Okay, so I want to get we have lots of points, so we can get the sky wheel card. Get some uh, points for Kate Sith. Get our cactuar. If you're looking to escape, the are you ready to embark on this Let's do. Let's go over to the Ghost Square. Just to see if there's anything new in the shop or anything that we missed before. I don't think. There would be. There was nothing new in any of the other ones, really. Just so you know, I was bitten by a zombie. A few yeah, days no, just ago. X potions. Okay, so now we're gonna we're gonna zip over to the only other place we haven't gone is the event square. I believe. Oh, and we gotta check out the Chocobo Square. We've arrived at um, to see if we can do any of the racing. Oh wait, we've been here. It's just I don't know if we bought anything. Yeah, sure enough, we did. But we can get the Loveless card and the poster. I shall eagerly await our next interaction. There's Barrett admiring some artwork. Oh, I guess there's nothing we can do here? Interesting. So I guess when you come here, this should be like... Like when you come here the first time, um, when you're on, on the, the little date sequence, then you should... I don't, I don't know if... If you come here first, if you get to do the play thing. 
Because that, that was like a big thing in the original, was you go to the event square, you get to do, um, you get to participate in the play. We didn't get to do that, though. This is just kind of here. And we apparently can't buy tickets for the Sky Wheel. Interesting. Okay, so let's go check in at the Chocobo Square then. I guess. Oh, cool. We're all looking forward to your next race. I'm sure you are. You treating your chocobos right? Ah, we're going to grab the hat. And I think that's all of the equipment that you can get. I don't know why those are separated, but... Yeah, so there's those. There's the scorpion gear, the Shinra gear from the Grasslands. Um, and then we have the extra gear that was available that we that we did manage to get. Got you, later. Got points. you betcha. Oh, we already got this stuff. Wow, a thousand. Um, let's try a race, I guess. Which of these races will you be competing in? I don't, I don't know if there's necessarily a difference. Oh, watch the way the saucers spin to keep up your speed. The conveyor belts help or hinder depending on which way their arrows point. I guess. Oh, interesting. Are these pre-built? So like, can we swap, can we swap the gear at all? Oh wait, these are, these are our birds. Gotcha. A little slow in the draw there. Okay, so you can customize them. Okay, so... Let's see, just for the heck of it. So, low speed, good acceleration. Cornering strength and intelligence are great, though. And the bird's low weight. So if we got one of these and we boosted the speed... Wow, that's a... Let's go for it. 
That's a lot of speed. That's a lot of speed. Not much acceleration, but that's a lot of speed. Um, I forgot how to race. <laughs> is it X to go or is it R2? Alright, let's go! Okay, R2 to drift. Aw, oh, man! Let's go! Oh, interesting. You only get two dashes? I thought it was three. Oh, and you don't get the extra speed boost. You get bird shot instead for the ability. So I guess the different birds have different abilities. Hopefully we can keep our lead here. Got our bird shot in case we need it. Start the drift early. Okay, well, we got that. So life's good there. Okay, I, I think we'll come back for these because I feel like this is going to be a little slower paced. Oh, cool, you can see what the track looks like. I didn't even realize that. Right in the middle of the screen there, it shows you where the track is. You know, just for the heck of it. Oh, duh, it tells you in the bottom what the, what the skills are. Let's go for one more. Why not? I know we, we have to beat the grade three races to get the uh, the thing for Johnny's Hotel. I like that they added like new tracks and stuff. Because in the, in the original, it's just the one game. Like it's just the one race track.
Wow. The range on that jump, man. Let's go. Hairpin turn. I'd much rather have the speed than... Oh, I totally missed it. The speed than the, the dashes. Because the speed is more consistent. The dashes are temporary. Dashes are good for the end. Oh, wait till we get to a nice straight stretch and do a dash just to keep to keep our lead. But we, we do have our speed burst to fall back on. Go straight over this. Coming up on a straight stretch here. Let's get a dash this time. Wow, we have a heck of a lead here. Holy crap, man. I can't dash? Really? Oh, I guess now I can dash if I need to. I didn't realize the dash just lasted that long. I don't know if anybody ever played it back in the day, but um, I got this game long, 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 long time ago. Um, back when I was a kid at, um, I think it was a dollar store or something. They used to have like a bargain bin with like old PS1 games. We're talking back when I was like in elementary school. Like, so right around the time when the PS1 came out and like the bargain bin games started to be a, a bigger thing. Um, but there was a game that came out. It was called Motor Tune Grand Prix. And it was like racing, but it was cartoony and it was, it was so cheesy, but it was, there was something about it that I just had to play it. <laughs> and I played the ever living crap out of that game. This reminds me a lot of that. Wow, that lead. That lead was actually ridiculous. Oh, you get new outfit for winning this too. I feel like those are probably gonna be really hard though. But yeah, yeah, okay. <laughs> I've had my fill of racing today. Oh, I bet you do. Um, I think we've bought everything from all the kiosks, unless there's kiosks in the main area? I don't think so. Okay, that's the speed square. That is the wonderment square. Um, there's nothing in the lobby, so... I think we cleared this place out, so can we... Can we zip back to... Over here? We can. Okay, so let's fast travel over here. And we'll take a quick run over to, um the hotel to see if if and how our collection has expanded and if we get anything for hitting a threshold because I saw we I saw we got a trophy for for something that looked to be related to the hotel got a furry friend who needs to burn guess we'll find out in a minute come to run wild. Hmm. Not the 
It'd probably be faster to get on one of those little scooter things, too, but... Oh, I completely bypassed it. <laughs> uh, this side. Caught me off guard because there's no more fence to walk through. It's changed so We'll display your donations with pride in our exclusive collection. Okay, 33 out of 88. That's a little better. So there's the poster. Huh, so that comes from the gold saucer then. Interesting. I didn't see anything else in there. Okay, well, let's go over to the dust bowl. Oh, that's not the right place. That's not the right place. Am I just dumb and not seeing it? Oh, it's because it's right there. I, <laughs> I didn't realize it was like right under the gold saucer. <laughs> it was a little further out. Okay. Oh, oh, we went and took the picture. We didn't check in with the uh, the picture guy. Where is... Oh, we didn't go get the picture. That's... Okay, well, let's go do that really quick, then. Of course, we need to get in the buggy to do it. Once you get the buggy, I don't understand why they can't just get rid of these sticks. It's so stupid that you have to have the buggy to go over them. Like, after you unlock it, there is no reason you shouldn't be able to just walk in and out of the dust bowl from this, from this angle. Okay, so let's go see the, uh, what's his face? Snaps. Ah, oh, he's in here. And we have to go all the way around, I presume. Okay. We had two of them. Down that spot. Quite the view you captured. I didn't realize Very we didn't nice. turn in the other one. I'd say you're a first-rate photographer now. If the association had any lingering doubts about you, this latest shot at this rate, you'll outrank me. But hey, friendly competition never hurt anyone. All right, seasoned photographer. Um. Okay, so there's nothing else left in there. So that means we have all the side quests done, all the Queen's Blood games done. We have one more, one more um, combat intel, and the uh, three more proto relic things, and the Moogles. Okay, so I think we'll call it here for now, for today. And next time we will we'll go straight for uh, the combat intel. 
and then we'll go take care of the stupid Moogles, and then we will take care of the Proto Relic stuff, and then I think we can be on our way. I do, I did want to go back to the Grasslands, though, and get the, um, just to fight that, that one, um, the enemy for the area, I forget what it was, it was the, the, the giant bird thing, um, just to get a Talon from it, so that we could do the thing with the item transmuter, because it was an item that we need, but, um, we might do that next time. Maybe we'll start with that. I, I don't know. We'll figure it out. That, that sounds like a tomorrow problem. <laughs> but either way, if you like this video, make sure you hit the like button. And if you want to see more videos like these, make sure you hit the subscribe button. And until next time, thanks for watching.